Welcome to the Pilates Show, where we explore Pilates tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. Hi, Jen and Amelia here again, and we're looking now at using the magic circle to change the angle of the femur and therefore the pelvis, right? Creating more space either in the inlet or the middle pelvis or the outlet of the pelvis um, through how we're communicating with the legs. So Amelia has the magic circle at her upper leg bone above the knee and she's gonna press her top leg in and let's connect the heels at first. And she's going into this very dramatic external rotation where she's pressing down and up, keeping the shoulders, ribs, and pelvis in place. And then she can release her bottom knee a bit and then she'll push back up into the circle as she goes into her lobster tail. So she's feeling the inner thigh coming back towards me. And this position is really opening up between her ischial sp spines, middle of the pelvis and sitting bones. And then she'll go back down and she can rest for a moment if she needs to. And then the heels will stay together and she'll go into that external rotation. So she's not only thinking about the top leg, but also the bottom leg, inner thighs moving out and up. And this is really helping actually in this position with flexion and external rotation to open the top of her pelvis. I know that that seems confusing to some. Drop the knee back down. And now we're gonna bring the leg back up and find internal rotation. So with that internal rotation, flexion and internal rotation in this position, we're finding an opening, a blooming of the sits bones and the ischial spines in the middle of the pelvis. And then back down, heels together, and now we have flexion, external rotation. This position is actually narrowing the sitting bones and opening the top of the pelvis when she presses up into the top of the circle for her external rotation. Good, and then go ahead and release. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.